I feel like I am flashing everybody um, my stuff. <laughs> Socialites, it is your girl, Nay the Untamed Socialite. Thank you so much for joining me today. I will be doing my first clothing haul of the year, a Zara haul. Like, why didn't you girls tell me about Zara? Like, I feel left out of the circle. <laughs> um, so if that is something that you want to see, please stay tuned. I do videos about just about everything. I do beauty, fashion, lifestyle. I have shared some things about my VSG journey. I will be sharing some things about my mental health journey. So if that is something that you care to see, please don't forget to subscribe. Please give this video a thumbs up. And um, yeah, what else? What else? What else? Like, comment, subscribe. What else am I supposed to say? Um, I don't know. So let's get down to this haul. I'm super excited. So. I am doing this Zara haul and I am super excited. If you've been here for a while, then you know that I've had VSG surgery. I'm one year post-op. Please um, look out. I will be doing a one year update video. I am in a size 810 now in bottoms and in shirts. I'm a large, extra large. And if it's super stretchy, your girl can fit a medium. Whew. Anyway, um, so I have been like, buying clothes and then once i try them on they're too big so i finally my weight has finally stabilized so i decided to take a trip to zara and when i say your girl has become a zara addict i am like searching everywhere i go is there a zara here oh if there's not a zara there then i just i'm not interested in it but anyway so i have a bunch of stuff that i purchased i um, did some online shopping. I've gone to different Zara stores. So you guys don't care about all of that. Let's just get down to this haul for real, for real this time. Don't forget again, like, comment, and subscribe. So the first two pieces, because this was a huge haul, so I did the pieces two at a time. The first two pieces that I um, am showing are these leather pants. Um, and I'm going to leave everything like I know people say the Zara website is confusing So I'll be leaving like the number um, The style number I believe in the description bar down below So it's these pants and this blazer that I'm wearing first of all. I love this blazer I was waiting in line um, at During one of my Zara trips and this lady had this blazer and I did not want to jump out of line So I ordered it online and it came very quickly um i'm wearing the pants in a size 10 which is a size 42 and the the blazer i'm wearing is a size extra large the pants were 49.90 for these to be like faux leather pants they feel real deal they feel so good they are lined i don't know if i'm keeping the pants because i'm 5'11 5, 10 on a bad day and I don't like the way that they like gather at the bottom they look good and then they just zoosh, at the bottom I did try them on with some heels um, after I was doing this haul and I, I like them um, but I don't know if I like them enough to keep so there's that this blazer I'm definitely keeping it is sexy it is linen she is an icon she is the moment okay this blazer let me see how much it retail for this blazer retail for $69.90 it is in this beautiful I don't know if this is like considered off-white or if it's ecru um I think they're the same color but whatever it has these high shoulder um pads I love shoulder pads I love shoulder pads okay there is no like lapel there's no collar it's collarless it is one of those um class button blazers and if you all like this piece is a piece to definitely keep in your closet it is a classic piece it can go with jeans it can go with a dress it can go with skirts this piece you're gonna see me rock this blazer a bunch this summer it is well spring um spring and summer it is linen and 
I love it. So let's get down to the next piece. So next up are is this leather set. Um, you're like, girl, where are you going in leather? First of all, it is April and where I live, it is still cold. The low was 37 yesterday. The high was 51. So leather it is. Um, so it's these leather shorts and they have these, um, like this gold, these black and gold buttons, which I think are really, really cool. I wish that the shorts were a bit tighter. Um, I got them in a size extra large. I probably could have gotten them in a large and they retailed for $35.90. I don't know um, that I can return these because I actually got these like a while ago when I was putting my foot in the sand in Zara and just not ready to pull the trigger. But they're cute. They're high waist. You know, I would throw these on with a pair of my Doc Martens or a pair of heels. Um, dress up or dress down. This blazer, I mean, Zara's leather, their faux leather is good. Like, good, good. Like, it feels like it's real leather. It even kind of smells like it's real leather. Um, but for the price, I know that it's not for leather um but it's 89.90 this blazer and it's a double breasted blazer um they have slight shoulder pads not as high as you know i would like but it's cute like it's cute to throw on with uh one of those uh satin little dresses it's cute to i mean i don't think i would wear the blazer and the shorts together but this is definitely a cute staple piece just to throw on if it's a cool night um, jeans, jean shorts, you know, you name it. But blazers never ever go out of season, if you ask me. Even even leather ones. So let's get down to our next item. So here we are. Unfortunately, this dress has to go back. I feel like I am flashing everybody um, my stuff. <laughs> This dress is in this beautiful, like I need more clothes this color. It is this beautiful chartreuse color. If it was two inches longer, I would keep it. I could wear it with jeans, but uh, I want this to be a standalone piece. It has these beautiful um, shoulder pads. It is a wrap dress. Um, a true, not a faux wrap. It is a true wrap dress. I got it in a size large and it retails for $69.90. I don't know if I would have gotten it in an extra large if it would have been longer. I highly doubt it. I'm really sad about this dress. I love this color. Hate the way it fits on me. Don't want to go to jail for indecent exposure. That's that. Let's get down to our next piece. This green, green is in, in all of the shades, the Bottega green, this green, chartreuse, all of the colors, like green is the color. I'm not sure what the Pantone color of the year is, but I wouldn't be surprised if it wasn't green. Um, I, if you followed me or been here for a while, then you know I used to love these like, satiny kind of dresses my body has changed i don't know that these dresses really do much for my shape um this dress was very cute i did have to put on shapewear with it um because of the clinging materials it's not this nice satin material it does not have much stretch to it i purchased this in a size large um this dress retail for i believe $39.90 or $49.90. I actually took the tag off because I um, wanted to put it on de wrinkle before I put it on. You're definitely going to have to steam this dress. I like this dress. I am going to keep it. I can dress it up or down. I can put some heels on with it or I can put on some combat boots and pair it with this leather blazer. I think that would be so cute. That is really what I want to do with this dress. But I have to be honest, you really probably won't see me in a lot of these dresses anymore. My shape has changed, my size has changed, and it just didn't do much for me. It looked cute, the color was beautiful on my skin, but overall, um, yeah, I mean, it is what it is. And uh, the top part fit a bit funny, and you all know I am part of the itty bitty titty committee, so 
if you have bigger large if you have larger boobs then i would say i'm not sure how this would fit in that area for you maybe don't wear a bra because it is tight so it will push the girls up so there is that let's get down to the next item in this haul so the next two pieces um are this beautiful gingham blue and white gingham textured blazer and these light blue jeans so i know if you've been here for a while last summer i was like the kids said skinny jeans was going out of style i'm still gonna wear my skinny jeans skinny jeans are still in now 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 skinny jeans are still in and are still in and i am still going to wear my skinny jeans but let's just say this moment in denim with these like wide leg 90s flared jeans are giving me life okay um zara's jeans are top quality they are absolutely great so these jeans are a size 42 which is a size 10 they retail for 49.90 i am again 510 511 511 on a good day 510 when my back is hurting and i'm slouching these jeans touch the floor like they are on the floor so if you are shorter i don't know if zara jeans come in different lengths but these are definitely tall girl friendly and I put heels on with them like in the middle of me doing the try on haul and they are great. If you care to see how I'm going to style these jeans, then definitely please follow me on Instagram, The Untamed Socialite. Now let's talk about this blazer. This blazer is gorgeous. I ordered this to wear for Easter. It did not come in time. It is what it is. Um, I ordered it too late and but i will wear this like this is beautiful it's nice it's like a nice heavy it's not i don't want to say it's too heavy because you can definitely wear this on like a 70 degree day and be perfectly fine i love shoulder pads so it has the nice high shoulders um it has these beautiful gold and like ivory color and printed buttons which I think was really cute. I purchased this in a size extra large. It retailed for $89.90. And you will see me in this a few times. Like it was worth every bit of my money. Um, they have this in pink and white. They have it in um, a green color. I think I wanna go back and get the green color. Your girl is trying to retire pink and not, you know, do so much of it and just incorporate other colors into my wardrobe. And I love this color. I love this blue. It looked great with the denim. Um, this would look great with like a white dress. Like this white pants, like white skinny jeans with a white bodysuit. Like this is definitely a statement piece. Get this, get this, get this. And for our next piece, I must be having like a clueless moment or maybe fashion is having a clueless moment. I know the 90s are back in. I am glad for it. I grew up in the 90s. Clueless is one of my favorite movies. Um, I just hope that we don't go back to like the flapper days and we're all walking around with gloves and those weird looking sequence dresses since fashion does seem to be repeating itself but anyway um so i got this is this i don't this is not gingham this this is a moment this yellow this reminded me of something that i would see in chanel okay and the gingham blazer too it it's a very chanel-esque um, it this is a very like it's not heavy it's not heavy to the point that I would wear it in the winter at all um it's very it's it's honestly a good quality for spring it's this yellow and white hound's tooth cardigan it has these beautiful um yellow um cloth buttons 
Um, I got this in a size extra large. I actually got it in a large and when it came, it was too tight. It didn't give what I needed it to give. So I sent it back and got a, an extra large and this retails for $45.90. And then these jeans. So again, Zara jeans, top quality. What I will say about the jeans at Zara is that they do not have any stretch. I was actually going to take these jeans back. I was walking through the store at the end of my trip and I just grabbed them because I'm like, oh, another pair of jeans in my size. Let me try them on. And when I tried them on, I fell in love. They are the classic mom fit. I got them in a size 42, which is a size 10. They retail for $45.90. I generally do not like boyfriend jeans, mom jeans, because I'm not really comfortable with the fact that I have to like, they don't touch the ground. I have to roll them up and I get it. That's the look. Um, so, but when I try these jeans on, they are just too cute and look too good on this new body to be sending back. Um, this, these jeans can be dressed up or down. Same thing with this cardigan. I would definitely probably pair them together again. I would do the cardigan with all white. These jeans are definitely going to make its rounds with me this summer. A uh, high quality denim, like high quality denim. There is not an elastic fiber in here. And I love jeans with elastic, but this is good hard denim. So yes, this is this. Oh, I just want to point out that they had the rips in the knees and some of this um, fraying and fraying around the waist, which makes them even more cute. So yeah, there is that. Let's get down to our next piece. I don't know what I was thinking. I saw this shirt and I don't know. Let's just, let me just show you. So next up we have this pink satin top it was a fail for me. Like it didn't give what I needed it to give. Like someone else is probably gonna rock the heck out of this piece. It just didn't do anything for me. It has a hidden zipper on the side. There is no stretch in it. I did not like the way that it fell um at my waist or torso or stomach or I just didn't like where it fell on my body um I I mean pink is my favorite color yes I just was not feeling this I wasn't feeling the sleeves were cute um I just didn't like it I, I just didn't like it and the jeans um, these jeans are, oh, let me tell you how much this shirt retail for. I'm moving too fast because I don't like it. So I got a large and it retail for $39.90. Uh, the jeans, they weren't my favorite either. They are the wide leg jeans and they retail for $49.90. I got them in a size 42, which again is a US 10. They are long to the ground on me. I didn't like the way that it fit in my backside area. I am now part of the itty, uh, bitty, booby and boob, booby and booty committee, okay? And it just didn't do anything for me. And they're, they were kind of big. I guess the rips in them maybe gave like way to the fabric, if that makes sense, it maybe like released it. They were long, they were past my feet, they looked would look great with, I could wear them with heels or with sneakers, but I just, they just didn't give what I, I wanted them to give. Um, again, they're high-waisted, nice and high-waisted. I wanna mention that about the other jeans that I tried on. What I loved the most about them were the fact that they were high-waisted, but she wasn't the moment. She just was not the moment. Let's move on to our next piece. I am actually sad about these pieces. Um, this bodysuit, I'm going to insert a picture of how this contraption is supposed to fit. I don't like clothes that confuse me. And this bodysuit confused 
the heck out of me. Um, it is in a size extra large. It retails for $45.90. It is this beautiful, like, blush color. Um, it is ruched, and I love ruching. Like, even smaller me loves ruching. Ruching is bay, But this just did not do what I needed it to do, unfortunately. And I'm sad about that. Um, I thought that this this bodysuit was fake. I was in line at one of my Zara trips. I saw a lady with it on. I couldn't find it, so I looked online for it, and then I went to Zara last Sunday. I found it. I'm like, yes, this is supposed to be for me, and then I tried it on, and I could not get it to look like how it looks on the page and then how I wore it I didn't like it and then I was able to like pull it up a little bit on my shoulders and it just didn't look how it looked on the site and yeah I don't like clothes that confuse me and I don't like clothes that constrict me at this point in my life um and then these jeans they were way too big um they are the super wide leg fit and they are in the size 42 so a us 10 they retailed for 49.90 and they have these <laughs> look i was about to stop and say something but they have these beautiful rips in them they're really cute they are just too big and i don't know if i got them in a size 8 if they would fit right in the legs like if it would then become a too tight in the leg i may try to um find these in a size eight and see what i can do because i like the idea of the jeans again they are super long i love this color but she just didn't work out it just is what it is we have to go our separate ways i'm sorry so the last thing I tried on, I guess this section of the haul would be the sad, disappointed section because I wasn't a fan of this either. Um, I tried on these, I'm so sad about these shorts, y'all. These Bermuda uh, embellished shorts and this embellishment is absolutely beautiful, okay? Um, and this white blouse. So let's start with the blouse. So I got the blouse in a size extra large. It is a beautiful blouse. It retail for $49.90. But this blouse honestly and truly is too tight on me. It's very tight in the arm so it fit awkward. Um, I would have liked it to fit a bit looser. I may try to get in an extra, extra large because it's a high quality blouse. Like this blouse is, I don't even know what the material is, but it is, where is the thing? It is just, it screams money. Like it screams uh, rich girl. It screams, I have on my Mademoiselle, Chanel Mademoiselle, honey, and I'm serving for the children. But it didn't scream that on me. It screamed that on the hanger. Um, so, yeah, I, I, I'm I returning this blouse. Um, and then these shorts. Oh, my God. These shorts are the moment. They are the cut-off shorts with embellishment. EDT 2022 Zara Signature Denim. And they are a size 10. They retail for $69.90. Y'all, I'm about to roast these shorts um the fit like even if i did still have like some junk in my trunk these shorts would not fit me okay they would still be that flipper bottom like i wish the shorts could just either be this just be the same length all the way around um and even if I like, they are a bit big on me. I probably could have gotten a size eight. A size eight still would not do or give what I would want it to give. Um, and even if I had my seamstress take it in, it would just make the flap in the back worse. I am really, really sad about this because I love, 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 love this embellishment. You all know I love pink and I love bling. And 
the bling just didn't bling. And unfortunately with this haul, the pink didn't pink either. So that brings us to the end of this haul. I had such a great time filming this. I really, really, really love Zara. Um, Zara has a hold on me and your girl will be returning. So if you care to see more of my Zara madness, then please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Um, follow me on the socials, The Untamed Social Light on Instagram. Stop by my website, theuntamedsocialite.com. Again, thank you so much for joining me on my channel. You could be watching anyone else and you're watching me. And for that, I am super, super grateful. Until next time, smooches.